no fap. You will be single forever. If you're someone who watches them dirty sites, you're definitely gonna be single forever. I can guarantee you that. Because what you don't realize is the consequence of watching dirty sites is that you're not gonna be able to find a person, a partner. Even if you do, it's gonna be temporarily before you're single again. And I'm gonna break it down in this video why that is. Now, before I do that, you already know what to do. Smash that like button, hit that red subscribe button and comment down below, bro. Let me know your opinion. Now, let's get straight into it, man. No fap, you will single forever. Now, why do I say this? You see, when you watch them dirty sites, there's a lot of negative things that come with it. Lacking energy, procrastinating, just messing up your mental health. This, this is scientifically proven, by the way. It messes up your, your mental health. Now, the reason you're gonna be single is because you're gonna have this expectation of a person that does not exist. You're gonna be chasing this fantasy person, this person that does not exist, have this body shape or has a certain aura or certain positions in the bedroom. Like you're gonna be chasing an illusion because everything in that you see on them sites is exaggerated, bro. The way the females look exaggerated. Most females don't look like that. All of them look perfect, like slim, slim uh, uh, waist and huge. Uh, all of them things is just artificial. They don't exist. So you're looking your favorite. You know what I'm saying? Your favorite piece star and that might be looking a certain way and you're looking for that person, don't exist. I'm telling you right now. Now, not, not only that, you're watching them and they're doing all sorts. They're doing some fantasy shit, bro. They're thinking, yo, I want to experience it. Because your, your mind is so used to conceiving these, these movements and these, this type of shit. And you're thinking, yo, I want to, that's what I want. And then you get, you, you get with a female and you're thinking, yo, she's going to do the, you know what I'm saying? She's not even doing that. You know what I'm saying? And then the way you, you, you visualize, visualizing yourself with that person, it's not going to end up like that. Cause these people are not real. It's all an like act. Like you see Superman, he's going to cape and flying in the air. That's not real, bro. No one's flying in the air. You see Batman in the Batmobile and he's just doing all sorts. It's not real. It's like, it's an act. Same as them dirty sites and people who are doing that type that type of ish there, that looking at that type of weight, it's all an act. And now you're going to be looking for that. Cause you're going to get with a normal female and she's not going to look one, the way you want her to look. Two, she's not going to do the way, the way, uh, well, the things that you're expecting her to do. And three, it's a complete different experience than you could even imagine. Do you know what I'm saying to you? So naturally you're gonna be with her, she's gonna be unsatisfied because you're gonna be sleeping with her whilst also watching that. And you're thinking, nah, bro, like I need something better, but I need to upgrade. Then you're gonna chase another female. Then you're gonna lose that female. Then you're gonna be with this one. And then same shit's gonna happen. Then you're gonna be single for the rest of your life, bro. Constantly chasing this mystery person, this mystery experience that does, does not exist, bro. Do you get know what I'm saying to you? So you have to realize that you're gonna to start to objectify females. You're gonna look at them as objects. And that type of, the one you're looking for, it does not exist. Now, the reason I say you're gonna be single forever is because you're always gonna be addicted to it. Even if you have a partner, you're still gonna be watching it. It constantly, you're never gonna escape the cycle. You're never gonna be satisfied with any female, but that's the bottom line. But every female is not good enough. It's not like your favorite P star. You know, your favorite P star is, a, you know what I'm saying to you? Like, so, what I'm trying to say to you basically is that you need to get on no fap. You need to quit it now, bro. I gave you plenty of solutions, what to do, working out, meditation, stop the urges, be productive. I gave you plenty of things. You can watch my previous videos on that. But if you're still chasing, it's like a dog chasing its tail. Like you're looking for, you're getting close, you're getting close, and then it gets away from you. You're never going to catch it, bro. You're never going to find that person. Do you get what I'm saying to you? So it's down to you, bro. You can do it. Plenty of people have overcome it. This is man's biggest addiction. Literally, man's biggest addiction. People like touching yourself is, is bro, it's, it's horrid, bro. You know what I'm saying? To you? It's, it's disgusting. Do you get what I'm saying? To you? I already gave you the spiritual perspective. Like, God doesn't want you to do that. God is watching. God didn't point his earth to blow your seed. God gave you the semen in order for you so you can procreate and that, so you can reproduce. Do you get what I'm saying? To you? So you can have offspring and children and grandchildren, and, you know, and they can have children. And like, that's the purpose of your seed. Nothing else. It's not there to just flip in, put on the on the on the on the bed sheet on a tissue or just to do some shit with it. You know what I'm saying? To you? The whole point of it, the reason that we have it, we use it to reproduce. That's why every that's what animal that you see on earth, whether it's birds, insects and that, they use their essence, their life force in order to procreate. It's only we human beings and that, or guys, so let's say, who are just wasting it, bro. Do you feel what I'm saying to you? So if you look, if you're someone who's single right now or looking for a partner, I'm telling you, going on no fap straight away, it's gonna make you get female. Now, I'm not, I'm not giving you the the placebo effect or or like saying that ah, uh, once you go on no fap, you're gonna be this superstar. No, the reason you're gonna get females if you go on no fap is because one, you're not blowing your seed, which means you're gonna be more horny. Two, you're gonna you're gonna lower your standard because if you blow your seed all the time, 
your, your standards get too high. Like, unless a female is looking 10 10, have the curves, is half Italian, half Latino, you're looking for this imaginary finger now. But if you don't blow your seed, your standards will drop, bro. I'll tell you right now, bro. The person who's like a 6 out of 10, 5 out of 10, they're going to start to be attractive to you. But if you keep blowing your seed, even if someone who's 9 out of 10 ain't doing it for you, bro, unless she's 10 10, then you're going to feel a type of way in that. Do you feel what I'm saying to you? So that's why it's very important for you to hold on to your seed. Because when you hold on, your standards going to drop, which is a good thing. Because naturally, when you look at a female like a young female you should be attracted to them they don't need to be 10 10 big booze big us they don't need to be have all that shit bro you know what i'm saying to you that's just a fantasy that you're craving a fetish that you're creating in your head in that so if you hold on to your seat you're gonna find even six out of ten five out of ten they're gonna be start to become attractive like whoa like you know i never looked at you like that you know what i'm saying to you when you hold on you know semen retention especially when you get to week one it, you're gonna build up week two by the time you get to one month yo <laughs> Any any female can get it, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? To you? Which makes you more likely to approach them, makes you more likely to talk to them, makes you more likely to be in a relationship. But if you blow your seed, then you have no urge, then you have no inclination to speak to a female because you know you can go home and play with yourself, and you know that your energy is drained, so you don't even care, bro. If the female is there, she could be ten ten, and you, you won't speak to her. But if you hold on, bro, if anyone has held on to the seed for like more than a month, you know what I'm talking about any female, but your confidence will rise because like you know what, I have this urge, I have this feeling but i need to go speak to fema i need to go you know, see an attractive girl let me go speak to her because like i need to do that in order for me to fulfill my you know what i'm saying to my urges but if you the easy option is like oh okay uh she's 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 hot but okay i'm just gonna go do this and that and then you don't feel like talking to anyone so the more you blow your seed the less likely you are to speak to anyone and if you don't speak to anyone then guess what you're not gonna have a partner you see you see what i said no fap you're not gonna you will be single forever because if you if you if you're fapping, then there is no need to look for female. If you don't fap, then there is gonna be a big, huge urge, bro. Like you want me to sleep at night. You know what I'm saying to you? You're gonna be DMing, you're gonna be approaching, you're gonna be doing all sorts that you didn't think you was capable of. You see, a lot, a lot of you guys think you lack confidence or you lack, like, you know what I'm saying, to, to, uh, confidence to speak to females. But really, the truth is that you keep blowing your seed away, which is not making, which is not giving you the motivation or the stimulation in order for you to go speak to females. Once you don't blow your seed, bro, you're going to see straight away. You're going to be dropping risks that you don't even know you had. You're dropping a different type of game. You're like, whoa, I don't even know I had this and that. Well, hold on for hold on for one month, see what happens. Or even one week, bro, or two weeks, bro. You're going to see straight away confidence is there you're gonna start making conversations you know what i'm saying to you so it's like that's why it's very important to hold on if you continue to blow your seed no energy no motivation you're not going to chase your passion or purpose you're not going to be talking approaching to females lacking confidence like bro it's too much negativity that comes with it bro like come on now you know this already it's way too much bro way too much negativity that comes with it mental health tired no no energy like why do you, you the game coming from like why why do we still do this and that like why not we like i ain't you know what i'm saying i don't do that shit but why do you still do it like why do you still do it when you know that it's just messing you up bro the moment you go no for every single area of your life will improve confidence will improve energy levels will improve everything will improve literally bro it's like a pff, yo it literally will change your whole life that's the biggest move you can make bro that's the biggest move bro it's not about like more it's more important to overcome that addiction than there is to make millions or billions but i'm telling you right now because like you can have millions and billions or you can flip and have whatever external thing you have but as long as you're addicted to that as long as you're still your joy is coming from that then pff, you're a loser you're straight up loser bro straight loser i ain't gonna i ain't gonna lie you're straight loser if i'm saying to you so if if you have any intention of having a partner having kids which you should have but each to their own then no fap will, 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 is the answer for you because then you, you you'll make the effort then you can start, you know what yo you know what like one you're gonna have the urge to speak to them two you're gonna think you know what let me get in shape so i can get a female you know what let me work on my business or get my money or so i can you're gonna start doing shit bro like get back into your masculine nature and uh, do the shit you're supposed to do go to work look after yourself and uh, have your you know what i'm saying to you your, your, your skincare routine and have your money right and have your physique right and that and get things in order to be in a position so that you can attract females rather than just being a loser bro and just thinking oh i don't need a female oh, i'll just flip and click on you know what i'm saying watch this, this p star and that like bro that's it bro i'm telling you that is the key for you to progress in your life for you to get a partner for you to have longevity to have children to all of these things all starts from no fat bro 
know what I'm saying to you? But day by day, you, you, you're not going to overcome it overnight, but make the conscious effort, bro. Because without that, then she, I don't know how you're living, bro. You ain't living right. You know what I'm saying to you? You're struggling. You're down bad. You're down bad, bro. You know what I'm saying to you? How many more years, bro? We're going to go through the same cycle. So that's the video done. Hopefully, bought a value. If it did, smash that like button, hit the red subscribe button, and leave a comment down below. Let's get it.